Hey there friends, welcome to another Paleo Pines video. I have been just a little obsessed with this game. I'm just, just a little excited about it. Um, so today I am determined to, um, I am determined to find the path to Dapplewood. I am determined to try and clear it, which means I have to befriend a dinosaur that can clear boulders. So I'm gonna be attempting to do that. I have to figure out how to get that done. So it's going to be slightly busy. Um, we're going to really try to figure that out because it's something I want to get done. It's one of the um, tasks I need to get done. So we're just going to do a little bit of gardening real quick. Now we'll say good morning to Pepper and good morning to Lucky. And we're gonna clean this poop. I'm gonna take the Lucky. Lucky would love more pen mates. Lucky, I'm trying I'm trying to find you some. <laughs> Pepper prefers a valley biome. Okay, well. Pepper, you you better stay where you are, ma'am. I did not put all that work in for you to try to leave me. Okay, Lucky, we are going to head to town. And by head to town, I mean just off the ranch, basically. I am going to put these away. I keep those. I'll grab the cranberries just in case. Go lucky. Okay, I really, really want one of these guys to be my friends. And I really kind of think I want this one to be my friend. Okay. I already messed up. Of course I got overexcited. 
Yesterday we were boring. Now we're too exciting. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Big summer blowout. <laughs> Come here. There we go. best when it comes to the flute and whatnot. It's gonna take me forever to make more dinosaur friends. Okay. You are kind of bored. I'm gonna give you another carrot because I am assuming you got overexcited because you liked the carrot. going to keep feeding you. I don't know if I can befriend it because I don't have a poppin. Like I can't befriend so I'm wondering if that's because I don't have a poppin. Freaking crap. Okay well it looks like I'm going to the plaza and trying to, I'm gonna have to get some poppins so I can make friends. These little guys are so cute. They are so adorable. I don't know how many shells I have. I guess it's baking day because Pippin's not here. <sighs> this is frustrating. Well, I'm just gonna try to, uh, I'm gonna try to find the path to Dapplewood and see if I can finally explore it. I believe that it's down this way. Okay, I'm gonna try not to stop and get things unless I see another dreamstone. Or if I see, like, the herbivore food on the ground or on the hill. Like, hills like that. Like, something that I don't have to get off of Lucky to get. I'm just gonna kind of ignore for right now. So I can try to get to where the path should be. Which I think is back here. Somewhere. There we go. Is this not it? There's a boulder right there, so it would make sense that this would be the path that I have to investigate. You guys just coming right up to me. Do I have to be unlucky to investigate the path? Trying to find this path is honestly ridiculous. Like, I have no idea. 
where it is. No clue. This is a really pretty little area. Yep. I'm gonna get some clover. Maybe take a look at the map. Maybe that's not it. Maybe that's just a path to a pasture. I should try by Mary's. Maybe that's where the path to Dapplewood is. so frustrated like I I literally have no clue where to find the path I am so confused And if I've found the path at some point, I have no idea how to investigate the path like I'm supposed to, to be able to clear it. Somehow, I just stumbled upon it. Oh no, it looks like the path ahead is blocked. <laughs> oh my gosh. This must be the boulder that Granny and Marlo were talking about. I'm gonna assume so, or freaking hope it is. Hmm. I don't think we can get past the boulder right now. Sorry, Lucky. Are you kidding me? I, I am just, wow, <laughs> all this time spent looking. <sighs> okay, well, now that we've done that, we can look, okay, the path to Dapplewood, I was finally able to investigate the path, and now I have to figure out how to cross the path or clear the boulder which I know I need a different dinosaur than Lucky and I'm gonna have to build up trust with the dinosaur so that it will be my steed I don't know how long that will take I have no idea where we are are now. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do some work around 
the ranch, just clearing some debris and whatnot. And then I'm gonna um, I'm gonna let Lucky just kind of chill, and I'm gonna get Pepper to follow me, and maybe that'll help raise my friendship with Pepper. Is a uh, by getting her to follow me around and be my friend. So she's not just in the pen all day. Okay. That's it for now, Lucky. just going to walk around with Pepper for a bit so Pepper can walk around the valley and then we'll just head back to the ranch close out today hope that Pippin is selling some poppins tomorrow that would be great must see something outside or is just being a little butthead because she just keeps randomly barking. Okay, we're just gonna put Pepper back. the friend call. Oh, oops, probably should do it right. I'll just see you later, Pepper. Okay, it's raining today, so we don't need Don't need to water our plants. Start our day by giving Pepper some pets and a treat. Pet Lucky. Give Lucky a treat. Go grab my shovel so I can shovel up that poop and we will go on a little adventure of trying to see if Pippin has some poppins for us and then we're gonna try to make friends uh, so we can hopefully Clear the path to Dapplewood. That's my main goal in this video is to clear the path to Dapplewood. That is my main objective. That's what I want to get done. So. Whenever I see Yoohoo, I just think of Frozen when the shopkeeper says uh, Yoohoo, big summer blowout, which is why I randomly am just like, Yoohoo, big summer blowout, because that's how he says it. <laughs> uh, come on, Pepper.
Okay, hopefully... Yep, there's Pippin. So, hopefully... We can get some Poppins. she's doing. Well, paint me purple and call me a beetroot. What do you need? Uh, just the person I was hoping to run into. The other day I promised Mary I'd whip up a classic recipe, potato, carrot, and spring onion stew. Only I'm out of potatoes. And carrots. And spring onions. Okay, to tell you the truth, I was thinking about something else when I made that, when I made the promise. Anyway, I'm going to need you to rustle all those up for me. Of course. Knew I could count on you. Run and grab those and get back here quick. Sharp. If you know what's good for you. Well, how much, how many of each do you need? 10 potatoes, 15 spring onions, and 20 carrots. I'm gonna have to buy seeds to plant those to bring them to her. Yeah, definitely gonna have to do some more gardening to be able to get her those plants. So she's gonna be waiting for a minute. I'm gonna grab this wood and the stone. And we are going to finally make us another new friend. I think you were the color one that I wanted. So kidding me. Hmm. Strachosauruses sure are stubborn. Maybe a different flavor poppin' would help. That's so frustrating. <sighs> Talk to Pippin. This is Just so so frustrating. Hi, 
Hiya, clumsy goober. Are you here for a poppin' or two? Poppin' anyone? The poppins are particularly crunchy today. Can I tempt you? Not exactly. What do you mean, not exactly? Is there something wrong with my poppins? What could be better? Another flavor? 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 The recipe for the poppin' has been in my family for generations. To change the recipe would be to laugh in the face of tradition and family values. Corlin. Hey, Corlin. Don't you think my poppins taste great exactly as they are? Honestly, not really, no. <laughs> there we go, Corlin. <laughs> Fine. I can't believe I'm saying this, but what do you think would make them better? Um, juicy. Juicy? I know you're new here, and I don't mean to be rude, but that's a terrible idea. In fact, I'll prove it to you. In fact, I'll prove it. You find me some strawberries or carrots, and I'll whip up a batch of juicy poppins for you. I've got some. Oh, I didn't think you were serious. Okay, fine. I don't like it, but I'll do it. Just for you, of course. Between us, this is going to offset the tooth rattling crunchiness that's the foundation of any good dessert. Here, one batch of, uh, juicy poppins. I swear, if my grandpappy could see what I've done to the family recipe, I don't even want to think about it. To be totally honest with you, though, I've been making poppins the traditional way for years. As much as I hate the new flavor, I kind of enjoyed mixing things up a little. So if they're your thing, then I could put through a special order on request. Anything else I can do for you? Poppin' anyone? Do come back when you need more poppins. I will. And hopefully I can finally make another dinosaur friend. <laughs> hopefully. see what Mary wants real quick and then uh -oh. try to make another friend. Howdy clumsy goober, great to see you out and about. I'm heading to the edge of the valley, heard strange noises over yonder late last night, gotta have a peek. Could you do me a favor, can you bring these to Owen if you get the chance? That's part of Owen's lunch. Owen was supposed to come with me earlier, but sigh. He's caught up in writing one more thing that boy really needs to get out from behind the desk. Can't wait any longer. Investigation awaits. Right after I finish packing, have an exciting day, clumsy goober. Well, Mary, if I can make a new friend, then my day will be exciting. If I cannot... I'm just going to be upset <laughs> and frustrated because I am trying so hard. I want the turquoise one. Yoo-hoo! Big summer blowout! Why are you charging me? Okay, this is it. This has to be the time. You will be my friend. And if not, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm going to be frustrated. right there and then I feel like it's gonna get overly excited but maybe I can soothe it a little bit of 
crap, I think that was too much. Another carrot? Yeah? Just a little carrot? Okay, we're right there. Hopefully... What is that? Oh, a bell pepper. When did I get that? me oh my gosh it finally happened I made another friend <laughs> we're gonna name it carrot <laughs> so it likes carrots What do you jokers want? What? Are you kidding me? You actually managed to befriend a Sterichorosus? Sterichorosar? Saurus? Whatever. Do my eyes deceive me? It's magnificent! The nose horn? It's got to be at least two hands long. Oh, three at least. And the peridial Squamosal frill is beautiful. Yeah. I'll say, I've never seen one up close before. It's amazing, isn't it? Doesn't it make you want to? Yes. It makes me want to go straight to my library. <laughs> what? I was gonna say, doesn't it make you want to go out in the field and see more? <laughs> no time for that. I've learned so much in these few moments. I need to head home and write some of this down. Of course, Owen. Though, the more I look, the more there is to see. I know what you mean. Wouldn't it be cool to see a different color? St wouldn't it be... Wouldn't it be cool to see a different color Strychorosus up close? That would be ideal. You go observe, and I'll head home and write down the details we've learned already. You don't have to tell me twice. Hanging with this Strachorosis all day sounds perfect. Excellent. Enjoy exploring with your new friend, Clumsy Goober. I hope they enjoy the ranch. I hope so too, Owen. I hope so too. Okay. Let's go, Lucky, Pepper, and Carrot. Let's go back to the ranch. Didn't really mean to do that, but okay. Full. Yep, yep, my inventory is full. Pepper, what are you doing? to increase the size of the pen so that I can put in another dream stone. I think that'll work. Am I going to be able to... Lucky has a saddle already. Yeah, I know Lucky has a saddle. I have two other dinos here. Pepper enjoyed visiting their home region today. I'm glad. 
Carrot needs a pen. I'm working on a carrot. Okay, I'm not trying to look at the trough. Lucky would love more pen mates. I am about to make that happen. Lucky. I just gotta figure out how I want to configure this. I think I want to... Yeah, I'm gonna have Lucky clear that area over there. And work... on maybe extending... this way some. best. Give them a little extra space. Yeah, you're going to try and extend it out that way. It took way too long for me to figure out how to configure the pen and move the moonstones, so I just went ahead and edited that out, and here's the finished pro product with all of the three dinosaurs and their new pen. Okay. I am excited that I figured out how to make a new friend. Excited that I found the path to Dapplewood. And we're going to call it quits for right now. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.